Hello and thank you for joining me. What I want to share with you today is actually revisiting a Sudoku solver that I created several months back. Now when I did the video on that Sudoku solver, just basically showing that it could be done, the version that I created was very inefficient. Right now what we're looking at is what is supposedly one of two of the world's hardest Sudoku problems. Now this one was reported in the Telegraph and when I originally ran it, it took my solver 29 minutes and 41 seconds to solve it, which is ridiculous. Um, in the video, I also said that whenever you run across a situation where your solution is inefficient, it never hurts to go back and actually fix it. Uh, you may have a solution, but there may be a better way to get to it. So what I've done is, again, this puzzle right here took 29 minutes and 41 seconds. So we're going to see how long it takes me now. And But first, we're going to go through and make sure we got all of our numbers. I've gone ahead and punched them in so that way you wouldn't have to watch me type. And we're going to hit solve it. And we're going to see what happens. If you do see an error, here, which I don't see anything right now, please feel free to shoot me a comment. And let me know what you uh, find. So just to let you know that the we came up with the solution um, in about 6.36 seconds. Remember that originally this took 29 minutes and 41 seconds. So going back with having learned a little bit more and really focusing on the problem at hand, I was able to kind of trim that down a good bit. Still, 6.36 seconds, it's it's a bit long. Maybe it could be better. Uh, I could blame it on the code. I could say it runs slow. But however, remember, we went from 29 minutes and 41 seconds, almost 30 minutes, a half hour, which was inexcusably slow. So what I did is I did some more research, and what I found out was that the puzzle that's listed here uh, that was created by this gentleman, uh, however, he created the puzzle as the world's hardest, but as you can see, the one that's listed here now on his website is not the same. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is uh, re-enter these numbers. I'm going to clear this. I'm going to enter these numbers and see how long it takes. Um, if you want to, you can go back, look at the solution that I came up with, and as you can see from this website, uh, you can go to this website, The Telegraph. If you just look up the world's hardest Sudoku, uh, you can pull this page up. You can also find the solution, compare it with the one I have. Again, if you find an error, let me know. I want to know. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to punch this puzzle in. So to spare you watching me type this in, I'm going to pause the video. Okay, we're, we're back and we have our numbers punched in. Now, I've never seen this puzzle before, so we're gonna all find out together right now if this will work and we're gonna see how, how well the solver works. I'm gonna go ahead and tell it to solve it and let's see how long it takes. Okay, 3.49 seconds. So in my opinion, this puzzle that's currently listed on this website right here as the world's hardest actually isn't as difficult, at least for my solver, isn't as difficult to solve as the one that's shown on this uh, Telegraph article. So again, I just want to revisit this problem because as I said in my previous video, uh, whenever we learn something and we implement it, it may not be the most efficient way. Sometimes we're just stringing things together with spaghetti code and uh, it never hurts to go back and show not only yourself, but others that, hey, we can do the same job better. So again, if you enjoyed this video, please click like and share with others. Thank you.